Hello, I am the Reverend Peter Postrib. I'd like to welcome you to this wedding which is taking place in the Great Tribulation. I'm sorry for the short notice, but I didn't want to have a long one because we're so busy running from Antichrist we can't count the days. So thank you for coming. I think you'll find a wonderful catered meal here. It's not the normal catered meal because we can't buy or sell anything. So what we have here is some coyote jerky. Now some people don't like coyote too much, but actually it's, it's all in the preparation. And we've been running from Antichrist and hiding in the hills so long, we really know how to make the coyote taste delicious. So we have some very wonderful coyote jerky for you. And then we have some special treat. A brother named Bert Cerrone is hiding in a cave from the Antichrist near Piru and he was lucky enough to catch a bear. So we have some bear meat available. It's a great taste. Bert's doing fine. He fishes at night and hides from the Antichrist, but to be honest, Dom's getting a little squirrely being cooped up in that cave all day. So I want you to really express some appreciation to Bert for bringing us his bear. And then we have some delightful pine nuts for you after the service. Also, the punch, it looks very rich and delicious, it's red, but unless you're Dracula, I don't think you're going to like it very much because it's the water in the punch turned to blood. So you might want to go lightly on that one. And finally, when you drive out, be careful because a 100 pound hailstone fell in the parking lot, so make sure you drive around that. Now let's get to the service. What is your name? My name is Andy Aftertrib. What is your job? I'm a construction worker in the tribulation. How are you paid? Well, it wouldn't do me any good to pay me any money because I can't buy or sell, so he pays me under the table with canned asparagus. Have any unusual things happened on the job? Oh yeah. We've had 100-pound uh, hailstones at the buildings. We've had people get stung by scorpions, things like that. Do you have any special ways to avoid the Antichrist? Well, as a matter of fact, I do. I have a way of disguising my voice with helium. I'll show you how it works. I'm not disqualified. Now I can go about the tribulation and nobody will know who I am. So that works pretty well. How are prices in the tribulation? Well, it's a quarter of wheat for denarius, and uh, it's really high. I mean, you should see the uh, hair transplants. I went by Bosley Medical, and I saw this one-arm guy coming out of it. I asked him what happened. He said they wanted an arm and leg for the transplant, but he talked him down. How is the funeral industry doing? Well, with all these people dying, there's stiff competition in the industry now. Thank you for your time. Please remember to run from the Antichrist. Okay, thank you very much. I wonder what day it is. I know. I'll check my calendar. Oh! Hey, are you the Antichrist? No, I'm just a kid. Oh. You scared me. I thought you were the Antichrist. What can I do for you? Well, I was just wondering if the name it and claim it theology worked in the tribulation. Well, I, I tried to name it and claim it, but nothing really happened until I gabbed it and grabbed it. Hey, by the way, do you know what day it is? I don't have a clue. Huh. I can't even keep track of what day it is. Well. See you later. Oh, 
Oh, honey, I would like to go to first base again.